Alrighty, here we go. Okay, so as it says in the title of this video, I really hope that no one watches this video. <laughs> it's not even clickbait, I swear. I'm just straight up nervous AF thinking about even posting this video for the world to see. Um, so becoming an artist has been my dream for as long as I can remember, but life happened and I had to shove that dream into my closet and forget about it for literally like 30 plus years of my life. Um, <laughs> I think I might, oh, actually, sorry, my nose is so nasally right now from allergies, I should probably take an allergy medicine, so on top of this video already going to be really, really bad, this just adds on to it, to how bad it's gonna be, so, yeah. Um, so I think I mentioned, I might have mentioned in like another video or future video, but you'll probably hear me talk about my past and how things got to where it is now because this YouTube channel will be about my art journey, uh, my small art business and just like all things art related because I'm really like at the age of 32 and a half finally going to pursue my dream. So. Yeah, uh, stick around if that's your cup of tea or type of video you enjoy. Leaving on in the background, <laughs> you should be doing something more important. Um, yeah, that sounds personal because it kind of is. That's what I end up doing every day. I watch one of my, or not one of my, but like I watch all my favorite YouTube videos of people and their like art studio vlogs and their small art businesses. I say it's for inspiration, but honestly, I'm just procrastinating, but yeah i mean maybe i'll become one of those people i'd be honored if you left me playing in the background but that's for another time maybe like five years from now um <laughs> so to be honest i'm a perfectionist if you can't tell well you probably can't because it's probably gonna be like the second video on this channel for like the umpteenth time but i freaking hate the thought of recording and posting videos of my sucky r right now like i hate having to like even think about showing the world what my art looks like but if I don't practice I'm never going to improve so I'm stubborn I love watching videos of how to draw videos but I actually never practice I know it's it's pretty bad like I'm pretty sure you're going to be judging me for this uh, I just pray that one day I'll pick up a pencil and start drawing we all know that's not the case but yeah so I decided I'm gonna take advantage of the fact that no one is probably going to watch my videos for the first year maybe here on YouTube so I'm just gonna record and upload as much as I can I'm sure along the way I'll get better at like making my videos and then like not being a lazy freaking meatball and like doing these voiceovers because right now I just don't want to don't want to show my face okay so um, heck, I haven't wasted years trying to figure out my art style before I even picked up a pencil. So yeah, I know what you're thinking. She's a complete idiot. I think so too. I just kept thinking that if I see enough artists on social media, it would like, I don't know, magically click in my head what style is going, like, what my style is going to be. But I just get sucked up into doom scrolling for hours and being other artists and just like, you know, supporting other artists with likes and comments and shares and stuff like that but anyway so a uh, youtube video popped up on my recommended algorithm the other day and i mindlessly clicked on it uh the lady was talking about how you should post a lot of bad videos at first because that's the only way you're going to get better gee so why does the entire universe keep telling me to do things i suck at well obviously to get my reps in yeah i don't work out either so um but i know the word reps and definitely what i should be doing yeah, yeah, I hear you. I'll start now. I mean, what better time than now considering I'm an unemployed lazy sack of potatoes. <laughs> Just kidding, but no really. I'm currently not working. I've been in this position before, three times now actually, where I waste my time doing busy work and not getting anything done around here. But this time around, I've been seriously journaling about how it's like a do or die, sink or swim moment for me. And mind you, I actually don't know how to swim and I'm also a very visual person. So I keep picturing myself in the middle of the ocean, flapping my arms for dear life. It kind of gets me in the right mindset, right? Kind of? I mean, I don't know. I guess this is how I like to torture myself. But, you know, if it works, it works. I don't know if it really does, but you know. So with all that being said, I really hope no one watches this video. If you did click on this video and made it this far, wow. I just want to say thanks for watching till the very end. Hopefully this wasn't too long of a video and I bored you to death. And if no one watched it, whew, I'm in the clear. Okay, bye. Thanks. See you later.